regal products. It's a regal Christmas on Copper Joe. This time we're going to kind of be showcasing the oats from regal. These oats are so versatile. I mean, they could use for all sorts of things. I am getting a little creative with it today and using it in my turkey stuffing. So turkey stuffing is a thing that could be very divisive. You know, you could, you could, some people want it turkey stuffing in the turkey and allow it to bake. Some people just want it separate on the plate. It's, at least in my house, it's a big, big thing. So every year we do it, you know, so one year I will do it in the turkey as I like it. And then my wife likes it out the turkey. So that next year I'll say, okay, we'll do the turkey stuffing out the turkey. And that's how we came up with this recipe. Turkey stuffing muffins. <laughs> We kind of crazy. Basically, guys, it's your turkey stuffing in a muffin pan that you can serve independently on everybody's plate. So if everybody wants a little bit of stuffing on their Christmas plate when Christmas lunch is being served with their turkey, you can just kind of get your own portion of stuffing. Yeah? Roll up, man. Mince meat. You could use sausages. However, you kind of do your... Your, 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 your stuffing. This is simple mincemeat, seasoned salt, pepper, a little pimento peppers in there. And I am kind of just going to get that going in my pan. So I'm making my stuffing. Just browning my meat. This will take a couple minutes. So my beef is ready and at this stage you would probably normally do some breadcrumbs but I'm replacing the breadcrumbs with these regal oats um, and I want about a cup of these regal oats in here I want to just mix it in. So the regal oats is going to dry up all that nice liquid and absorb all that nice liquid that the beef would have released. Now I can start adding some vegetables. So I love mushrooms. It's not a must in the recipe, but I just love mushrooms in, in, in my stuffing. So I get some mushrooms in there. Raisins. Some regal raisins. I'm going with some olives, some capers, and I have some lovely almonds from regal as well. What I like about Christmas stuffing and turkey stuffing is that you can kind of do your ingredients. Um, it's really a simple kind of step you have to just follow once you have a nice meat as a sausage or, or the people who do veggie stuffings as well to each his own <laughs> I like a meaty stuffing get everything nice and incorporated there and then I'm going with some liquid so I have some chicken stock so I have a cup but I'm adding about a half a cup of liquid. <laughs> you, you, you want to, don't put the whole cup in, you know. Add the liquid so that you can see how much liquid you need. Because if you add all of it, my wife always tells me when you put it in, it's always difficult to take it out. In the kitchen, right? <laughs> but, so you don't, add all the liquid in one time because then you won't be able to take it out. Got it? <laughs> I 
I need some more liquid. Just a little more liquid there. So just when the liquid is kind of being absorbed, you don't want it too wet, but you want it nice and moist just as it's coming together here nicely. Oven at about 375 degrees. And my trusty muffin tin, grease muffin tin. And all I really want to do here now, guys, I'm stuffing muffins. Nice ice cream scoop. And I get them in there. Isn't that cool? So your turkey stuffing has its own little portion. So nobody can complain somebody get more stuffing than them. Individual portion size for your stuffing. And here we go, it goes in the oven guys, 50 to 20 minutes and these will come out some beautiful individual stuffing muffins to serve up with the turkey on Christmas morning. Let's go! So I'm going to check if my stuffing muffins are ready. Just about 50 to 20 minutes in here. And all you really want is for them to kind of come together like little muffins. That's basically what you want. So, as it is here, everybody has their own little individual muffins. It's so cool. Christmas play together, everybody gets their own stuffing. I add it with some, some nice slices of turkey. Just want a little green on the plate. Yeah. Bits and bites. Get the recipe on coppajocaribbean.com. Bits and bites on Christmas morning. And when you say bits, you say, take all his money. Take it, take it, take it, take it. <laughs> Fellow, what is that? I'm amazing. I'm amazing. What's up, Joe? How are How you? you? Same to you, same to you. Who's on the show now? Have a seat. Take all my food, and then you take all my money. Take all your are you, food. Are, are you a stuffing girl? You like turkey stuffing? I just love Christmas. Yeah. I really look forward to Christmas. Well, you know, I like my belly when yeah. I reach on the show. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I look forward. Yes, and I do love stuffing. Yeah. It's something that my mom does every year. And she does it? In the turkey, she stuffs it in the turkey. She, no, she actually bakes it separately. Separate, so this is what kind of this is. Correct. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Think of that. It. Think of that with your Christmas, your macaroni pie. Oh yeah. And your yeah, and your, and your turkey and your baked pork, whatever you do on Christmas morning, and everybody gets their own stuffing muffin. Guys. 
I really love those food. <laughs> I'm probably gonna eat the whole thing. <laughs> you can talk, but I'll eat. That's no problem. At While all. she eats the whole thing, we're coming back because we have one other little surprise for Bitsy, and then we sit and chat just to find out how she's taking everybody's money this Christmas, and I'm sure into Carnival as well. <laughs> Um, it, is in, it is in everything mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, 